today I'm trying something that I have never tried before. Today, we are building as close to oil rig as we possibly can. I did just hear an explosion though, which made me think that there's someone else very close by. There we go. A hundred thousand wood. Okay, here we go. So why won't this let me build any further up? I'm going to assume that that means that I'm, I'm as far out as I can get, I don't know. I must be as far out as I can get, I suppose. Right, well we'll start building up from there then. Is that what it means? To, that must be what the terrain things means, right? Like, that, that I'm as far out as I can get. If I can get an L9 or something like that, I can camp it from here properly. But it's getting one CR bit. I'm going to have to do the rig to get one in the first place, you know, I suppose. Let's worry about building. Building up first. Okay, so um, but building is absolutely never my strong point. So this is this is a real headache, if I'm honest. Like trying to get your head around all the stability stuff on the fly is it's tricky, man. Maybe that's as high as we can go then. Can we do half walls? I think we do half walls. That's got to be it then, isn't it? That's got to be as high as we can go. But from here, so at least now, I think, if I get up all the way up here, can I put a floor piece in here yet? No, no floor piece in there. Which is really strange, but never mind. But if I get all the way up here, at least now, I can land a mini on here. Literally none of this makes sense. That'll have to do, I suppose. I don't know why it won't let me demolish these on. Because I can't stack TCs. That doesn't make sense. Right, okay. Well, at least we've got this done. Next mission is to... How am I going to seal this up? Because at the moment, anyone can just... Anyone can just jump on here at the moment. Well, we'll have to seal it with doors, I suppose. This is about as close as we can get. We're sealed there. What? I don't understand this. Am I missing any door frames down here? No, no, no. Literally every corner's got something on it. Got one there. Maybe that. Maybe that will help. Oh, there we go. Sealed. Right. Okay. So I'm gonna treat that like a bunker. Just seal myself in with that. Um. So let's. Okay. So what we're gonna do is gonna F1 here. Go back to. 
base, get a heli, get some guns, and then we'll go to rig and start making some plays because this has taken fucking two hours. I haven't done anything yet. What I'm going to do is take the scrappy out there, get that scrappy on top of the base because I can take some gear with me then. Let's take some guns, some ammo. Not that I've got a lot, but. I was really worried that cargo had just wiped it out, man. is so scuffed but it's about as good as I can do at the moment what's happening at rig can we see anything more more Jesus is that a rib there no, it is, isn't it? right well they've just taken that so I'm gonna have to wait for that to respawn now no other crates anywhere else on the map let's just gonna have a little bit of a farm up while they're waiting for that to respawn shooting at me from rig. I can't believe they're just, they're going to be just throwing supply signal after supply signal now, aren't they? Until that crate respawns and then they'll get that. Might have picked the wrong rig, but if I'm lucky, wouldn't have done that one. They'll go to large rig and crack on up there instead. I could grab another heli and try and counter them, but there's a group on it. If I'm outnumbered, I'm fucked. There's no ifs, ands, or buts. I mean, rig with scientists is one thing, but rigs, for me, countering a rig is, especially if it's a group, is a big fat no no. So I'm trying to find a heli. Jesus. Beamers are out. Let's see if we can get that crate that's at train yard. I mean, I don't think for a second that I can, but it might be fun to try. Keep forgetting that the animals on here don't move and those bears scare the fucking life out of me. respawn so let's find a heli head back to the base the swan I saw one just did but maybe I was wrong <laughs> that giant base had a sound sight on it didn't it of course it did Bolty, that comes in handy, especially if we want to be camping rig. Right, let's see what we can do.
can't get to top level from here, not properly. So I'm going to have to clear the top when I get there. Oh, there's a mini up here. Come on now. Destiny. Oh, I don't have a blue card though. That's annoying. Um, maybe there's one in the green room. Alright, let's go lob the supply signal and open that room and see what's in it. Beautiful. And depot some of this real quick. First run. Depot. That's kind of massive. See, this is what I wanted to be able to do. I wanted to be able to hit all that stuff and be able to depot stuff and then go straight back before any of those supply signals have even landed, you know? This one. Where's the other one? Is the other one already landed? Yep, there it is. Nice, nice, nice. Right, I can now a little clear up. Get all the bits that I forgot to get before, or didn't get before. Seems like a lot of the crates have respawned as well. The reason I left a lot of this loot behind as well is because I wanted to make sure that, like, I got the stuff back that I really wanted. And I knew this stuff would be here if I could get back afterwards. It was just the other stuff was like a bit of a priority, you know? Shame there's no card spawns here, though. That would have that would have been like the icing on the top, you know? Got more than a thousand scrap on me now as well. Huge. Not a bad run. Not a bad run at all. So one big run back to main. I mean, guns are pretty easy to come by, so I'm only going to take um, Sars and Tommy's. Meds, 5-5, five, five, satchels, and anything like that. The bolt as well. Keep hold of that. I mean, it is pretty epic, isn't it? It is pretty epic. All that. All that just for one oil rig run. 30k wood. God knows how much of everything else. The terrible base build at both ends. But at least we know we're on the right track now. Now that's made me feel pretty good about playing tomorrow as well. Like I know that with like some honing, this is going to be really, uh, going to be really fruitful. Yeah, this is going to be, uh, it's going to be worthwhile. I think what I'll do tomorrow as well is extend out the walls off this so that you have an almost full tunnel the whole way there. You know. Right, everything's armoured. Let's just go to the outside. Yeah. Right, everything's armoured. Everything's solid. I've got a wooden door on it, but I, I, I don't think that's going to be too much of a problem. I've run out of time anyway. Now this can go back in there. How much upkeep have I got? A day. Okay, yeah, we've got enough upkeep. Wait, that goes in there. Until tomorrow. At the end of today, I wasn't crazy about the state of the base, because let's be honest, it's a mess. I'd had a good run through rig, though. Got a lot of loot and I was psyched about playing tomorrow. It seemed like it was going to be very, very fruitful. But unfortunately, the server had other ideas. Fuck, like we got raided then. There might be something that's salvageable. Let's go and have a look. Although I didn't have a bag, I didn't even have a bag left, so I'm not feeling overly confident, if I'm honest. I'm going to go and check out, see if anything's left out in the ocean as well. Well, there doesn't seem to be anything left here, which makes me believe that there's nothing going to be left out here either, but we'll go and, we'll go and have a look, just in case. Alright, it's all gone, isn't it? It's all gone. 